<laughs> you want me to read your meme? Sure. Just gotta find one. Here's a conversation between a person named MLM Care and a person named Phonus, right? Okay. So MLM Care starts their post with, I love boys who love horror films. Let's cuddle and watch people die on screen and make fun of the special effects. Where's my slasher fic boyfriend? Right? Mm -hmm. And Phonus responds, squints my eyes from behind my cavalry helmet. You again, Advina. What did I tell you about trespassing on Roman land? I shall show you a slasher. With a fearsome echoing, Veritas, I lunch at you, defending the honor of my empire. Um, Emily and Kira responds, if we had a wall of fame for inane and nonsensical comments, this would be at the top of the list just because of the sheer what the fuck factor. Good job, thumbs up. Bonus responds, fool, while you were ta talking, my men have surrounded you. Your blog is officially under siege by the Imperium Romanian. There could be only one homosexual empire, and it is us. Really? Isn't that good? Sure. Um, the fuck is this post? Oh, I see what this post is. Uh, you know who, who is Warrior Mail, and why is Warrior Mail so fucking famous on Tumblr? Because Warrior Mail is an icon. I've never heard of him before. I've uh, he like talks in this in this very extra way, and also. Uh, at some point, he said that turfs suck, so that's always good. Yeah, but he, like, having a name like Warrior Male already to me seems like a red flag, you know? Yeah, that's what makes him so good. <laughs> but he's he got like that really big red guy. flag, and he just, like, you know? And he's still a good guy. Here's what Know Your Meme says about him. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, I really want to hear this. Warrior Mail is a Tumblr blog which roleplays a celebration of manliness through combat in the ancient Greek tradition. Their posts often feature wisdom from men presented in bolded text. While the sincerity of the blog is subject to debate, the blog's hypermasculine style of general positivity, inclusive inclusivity of gay, trans, and men with disabilities and its respect for women has helped to generate a large following on Tumblr. That actually wasn't a terrible thing to write. I'm, I'm proud of Know Your Meme. Well, it is. It isn't like an accepted submission. No, but it's still good. They're, they're all it, probably just denied because it's not up to their standards. Here's a gif of Shaggy from Scooby-Doo and the Ginger Kid from Jimmy Neutron doing the Macarena. But I can't exactly show that to you. Okay. Mm -hmm. So here's a post that it's better to read than to listen to, but I'll still read it to you. Um, this is a conversation between Monetize Your Cat and Boys and Berets, right? Uh huh. Just found out there are two bones in my shin, and two shins on my body. That's four bones. Fuck this shit. In response, Boys and Berets says, Dude, that's not even the worst of it. Go look up what your ribs are made of. Monetize your cat says, okay, I will, but I'm warning you, if it's bones, I'm going to be so pissed off. Uh, you, you have heard of why the Big Bang Theory is coming to an end, right? No. Oh, yeah, earlier I saw a picture that I wanted to send, but I wanted you to, like, specifically see it, and I didn't want you to not respond to it. You know what I mean? Mm hmm So I'm going to send you that picture now. There you go. Read it out loud for me. Man says to doctor, doctor, I have a problem with my bottom, which is censored for some reason. <laughs> doctor says, let me check. Man, can the nurse check in in instead? <laughs> okay, nurse, come in. It's a man with a hook. <laughs> <laughs> Moral of the story. <laughs> Nurse is a man. <laughs> Alright. It's so weird. <laughs> I fucking love that shit. Alright. Is this like the man hook car door thing? <laughs> what? <laughs> what are you talking about? Do you remember that, that meme? No. Hold on, I let me... when I see it. Man door, hand hook, car door. <laughs> what? 
What are you, Adam? What are you talking about? All right, I'll I'll read up the the know your meme description for it, <laughs> which is really good. Okay. Mandor Handhook Card Door was the title of a 4chan post of somebody trying to tell a creepypasta story. Oh, it's one of those like six word stories. Uh, no, there's more to it actually. Let oh, me okay. read up the whole story, okay? Okay. Man and girl go out to drive under moonlight. They stop at on at a side of road. <laughs> he turned to his girl and say, Baby, I love you very much. What is it, honey? I can't. <laughs> That's not the natural response. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. Our car is broken down. I think the engine is broken. I'll walk and get some more fuel. Okay, I'll stay here and look after a stereo. There have been news reports of <laughs> stereos being stolen. I'll go look after the stereo. <laughs> In case it runs away. <laughs> Good idea. Keep the doors locked no matter what. I love you, sweaty. Sweaty. So the guy left to get full for the car. After two hours, the girl said, Where is my baby? He was supposed to be back by now. Then the girl hears a scratching sound and voice say, Let me in. The girl doesn't do it, and then after a while, she goes to sleep. The next morning, she wakes up and finds her boyfriend still not there. She gets, <laughs> she gets out to check and man door, hand hook, car door. <laughs> What? Is that how it ends? Yeah. <laughs> God, I love the internet. It's so absurd. Man, okay, car door. <laughs> oh, okay, I hope in the future that my significant other will, when I reset to them, baby, I love you very much, that they say, what is it? <laughs> <laughs> And I also hope that if I ever leave and don't come back for hours on end, they just go to sleep. I hope that's what happens. <laughs> I like that one. Okay. Um, should I do DirectX 9 or 10 or 11? <laughs>